that we have up next is on mm -hmm, fire. That's and we're right. all looking for a little insight and inspo when it comes to all walks of our life. Yeah. I can relate. And if you're in the process of creating a business, powering through some of the challenges, can be easier said than done. No kidding. Well, it's time to keep calm and conquer your world. That's the message behind the captivating book, Embracing the Calm in the Chaos, How to Find Success in Business and Life Through Perseverance, Connection, and Collaboration. Some good buzzwords I like there. the way that sounds. Yeah. Okay, joining us this morning with more on the whole shebang, uh, embracing our calm in the cast. Stacey Eagle, thank you so much for yeah. being here. Thank you so much for having me. I have been on Zooms for three years. Welcome. And Welcome. Let's I'm embrace. Let's embrace. embrace. Welcome. Welcome. I'm embracing the sweaty palms. <laughs> I'm here. That's right. Yes. So nice to be here. Thank you for having it me. It is wonderful to have you here because I think we are anyone. I would never speak on behalf of anyone, but I'm going to take a liberty today. Anyone can relate to trying to overcome something, trying to conquer something, trying to be at peace with something. Yes. Can we start a little bit with your business and some of the things that you learned in the process? Yes. Um, so my business is Boy Meets Girl. Mm -hmm. It's a mission-driven brand. I started 20 years ago. I'm a Chicago girl from the Midwest. Came to New York City to fulfill my dream, and here I am. Mm -hmm. And the brand has been giving back since the day I started. I started uh, the week after 9-11. Um, I was supposed to have my first trade show. And I was a young designer, you know, deciding if I should go out and do this yeah. after this tragedy mm. had hit our city and a month later they decided to have the trade show mm -hmm. and I believed that I would go out there and go forward with what I always dreamt of doing but I would be an impact brand from the day I started so that line was donated to the American Red Cross from victims of 9-11 and their families and I led the past 20 years leading with that mission to give back through the brand. Talk to folks who are unfamiliar with that term, impact brand. Yes, what is that? yes. Actually, my husband said that to me last night. He's like, <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Layman's term. Right. So um, impact is through the through the brand, we're elevating voices and working with nonprofits and activists to share different causes. Yeah. So whether that's anti-bullying, Breast, can, breast cancer awareness, immigration. Um, I have a, a partnership with immig Immigrants Are Us with the Human Rights Watch. Vote a Latino to mm -hmm. talk about voting with uh, Rosario Dawson's company that she's a friend. Um, and we work with activists to elevate the youth about voting. Yeah. Oh my so gosh. throughout, from 2001 to 2020, taking the brand and bringing impact to the forefront right. and sharing stories. It is a genius concept, mm -hmm. by the way. I know Rosaria, too. Lower oh. East Side Girls. We love um, it, and I worked with the Lower East Side Girls Club. 20 girls shadowed me with my Wycuff John show <laughs> with her. We're going to have a set. We're, yeah. yeah. we're just yeah. name-dropping. Yeah. Yeah. I know. I'm, I'm here. I'm good. But the 20 girls came from the Lower East Side Girls Club, and they had each person was part of a team yeah. to learn about the business from the ground up. It's it's we're all consumers. You and I are uh -huh. massive consumers, uh -huh. but it's really putting your dollars, knowing that it's going to go towards something, something yes. good that's going to give back to the community. And bigger in than some all way, of us. So yes. kudos for being Thank an you. impact brand because it's, it's very important. I, I mean, we could just go on about your business and all the incredible work that you're doing. But talk Thank to us you. about the book because it's today. It's today. Today's the day. Pub day. Yeah. This is you are, It's amazing. A 40 it's, second a second. Embracing the calm and the chaos. What do you want readers to take away? So this is my memoir business book. Mm. Um, you know, I take you through the beginning to now of my life story and my journey. Mm -hmm. And it's a business book because there's takeaways through what I've learned along the way. And so I want people to understand that it's not easy. Yeah. It takes a lot of belief and strength and perseverance. And if you believe in what you're doing, you can succeed. But there's going to be highs mm -hmm. and there's going to be lows. And I weave into my journey 30 different stories of my friends along the way, my oh collaborators, my, my community. And I share their inspiration and their story from actors, musicians, business leaders, execs. So it's just well-rounded perspective here. Mm -hmm. It is. And it's through incredible. my journey yes. of my story of building. It's a... Uh, you know, it, it amazes me because you are so composed, oh. you're, so <laughs> you're so put together, but I'm Thank sure behind you. all that comes 20 years of Ajita and sleepless yes. nights, yes. and I wonder if you could give a piece of advice for someone who is watching you and following in your footsteps and wants to embrace the chaos, what do you say to that person? So 
I thought about, you know, this as I'm preparing for my whole journey. And, you know, there's this first step of where you sell your clothes or your product, and there's three pieces bought at a store, right? And you celebrate that, and you're like, oh, my God, this happened. You know, I was on the Lower East Side um, selling my first product, and someone bought three pieces. Mm -hmm. And then you get to this other step, and there's ten more pieces Mm -hmm. bought. And you still celebrate it because you have to celebrate your success. And then I'm in every major retail store across the country and licensing globally. And I'm partying up there, too. (laughs) But along the way, you know, if I didn't celebrate those milestones, I, you know, what is the point? And so to an entrepreneur who's starting out or in the midst of it, five years into it or ten years into it. Celebrate even. Celebrate. And speaking of celebrating, you've got a a little event. Oh, oh my God. An event. Bloomingdale's. Yes. Yes. Um, Well, so I've been partnering with Bloomingdale's for 20 years in my business. Oh, my gosh. It's an amazing partner. They're celebrating Women's History Month all month. And on March 11th, I will be bringing a party. Excuse you. Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, um, this seems like it's going to be amazing chaos. In the yeah, amazing chaos in the carousel with a DJ with um, alcohol by Frisky, Frisky Whiskey. Whiskey. Oh, okay. Sounds she's, fantastic. It's Frisky. She's making calm and chaotic drinks. Love and it. We have we love the a theme. First twenty people who buy the book get a portrait by Sophie Albert Sophie Elgort's company Click House. So. Come join us. It's a win-win. Yes. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you so much. We'll you have all this on our website, too. Copy a, 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 pick up your copy of Embracing the Common and the Chaos, How to Find Success in Business and Life Throughout Perseverance, Connection, and Collaboration. Woo! We'll be right back.